Pageant Confidential continues. Once again, Lara Spencer. In the sunshine state of Florida, the contest is more show than pageant. We've been competing for five and six years together, and so we have created our own little sorority here. One Miss Boca last year in the same year competed top 10, and then this year I miss Miami's. The art of swimsuit comes naturally. It gets you pretty dark. After all, this is the land of sun and surf. After sucking in those tummies, a little guilty indulgence. I take a cookie, thank you very much. We reward ourselves right after swimsuit with the best tasting brownie ever, and I probably have chocolate in my teeth, so please excuse me. <laughs> the talent competition offers variety and maybe a raised eyebrow or two. No Libra Like after I got off the stage, I felt like crying. So, yeah. I think it did good. The champion baton twirler rocks her performance. Being world two baton champion for the nation it's finally paid off. <laughs> <laughs> I got to come to Miss Florida with my very best friend in the world, and we both had no job talent routines. We twirled our little hearts out, and it was perfect. Yay! Yay! And the night was about to get a lot more memorable for Miss Palm Coast. Your new Miss Florida. Miranda Jones is Miss Florida 2013. Well, I'm going to let Miranda breathe for a couple of <laughs> moments, <laughs> and then we start preparing for Miss America. It's going to come quickly. Mary Sullivan is the hands-on executive director of Miss Florida. Do we have any other TV interviews? And each year, she gets her state representative ready for the national stage. Uh, which part do you think the reality will set in first? Probably not for four or five days until I leave to go home with Miss Mary and go to Camp Mary. <laughs> Camp Mary, that's Mary Sullivan's beauty boot camp. Miss Florida will move into Mary's Miami home, which is a virtual shrine to all the Miss Floridas before her. How many times a day are you supposed to eat? It is a 24 hour a day, seven day a week regimen. Okay, what I can eat in here. Um, well I could have fruit up until yesterday, now I can't. Carrots and broccoli. I'm here, and once we got into the house and settled into the new house, it's been completely focused on Miss America. Really? Tried to get all fancy. Lots of energy right there. There's extra pressure this year, too. The Miss America pageant is four months earlier than usual, leaving the state winners only weeks to prepare. I have focused and have prepared for this moment my entire life. Picking an evening gown could be such serious business. I've seen anything from mine $400 to $4,000, which to me is insane. But some girls being on Miss America stage is a bigger day for them than probably their wedding. Wow. Okay, turn around. And Miss Florida misses zero opportunity to remind us she is in it to win it. It's not a vision of what I want. It's a vision of whether or not I can do this in it. <laughs> When you're crowned, you mean? <laughs> no, I love it. I do love it. I found the dress. <laughs> <sighs> While the dress works, she's convinced her voice doesn't. Working to improve it looks like this. How are you doing today? I always eat lunch at 7. A little high pitch kind of bringing it down, making her aware of that. There's Mary nitpicking like a pro again. Last year, it was this. We've got to do something about 
the fact that your bed is flat. I mean, I'm sorry, but that... <laughs> the purpose is a, of it is to be speaking and pushing from your diaphragm rather than pu pushing from your throat. I am Miss Florida and you are not. That's my favorite one. <laughs> Mary's feeling pretty good about Miranda's progress. Awesome. You know, my only complaint, and it's not a complaint, because I know that you abs absolutely, but I want you smiling from here. Oh, yeah. Even when you're practicing. Okay. Have it come from here. Because the deer in the headlights is kind of like, mm -hmm. <laughs> so I want you, I want it coming from in here so that there's never any question that that smile is in there. Great, love it. I don't think it's truly set in that it's only a month and a week away, but I'm ready, I'm very ready for it. But she has no idea that even Camp Mary won't be able to prepare her for the unexpected twist she'll face at pageant time. It is exactly one month before the pageant. Miranda has a chance to size up her competition at an orientation in Orlando. And a fun fact about me, I can change a NASCAR race car tire in 6.2 seconds. I can talk like a chipmunk. Well, I'm hot, I'm pussy and I'm a thrill. <laughs> I have really double jointed fingers. <laughs> A group trip for the contestants to Disney World offers a moment of fun before things get intense. Can I get a hug? It's also a chance to schmooze with young fans. This guy is more than a little taken by Miss South Carolina. I can show you the world, shining, shimmering, splendid. The great state of Oklahoma, famous for its oil and its vicious twisters, is also home to something else. These are our three Miss Americas from Oklahoma City University. And so we make statues out of our Miss Americas. Oklahoma is tied with Ohio and California for the most Miss Americas ever. Six, and Kelsey Griswold wants to be next. There you go, good job. Come on. Your last one. Getting ready for Atlantic City on a shortened timeline right with just two weeks to the competition doesn't fluster this pro. Two, come on, one more. She's been competing in pageants your, for uh, years. Those lines, see that line right there that came out right there? Do it again. To get ready, Kelsey's regimen includes sculpting her body in a rather untraditional way. How to fight with swords it makes me fierce. So if the sword gives Miss Oklahoma an edge in the competition, maybe this will too. I am the reigning Oscar Mayer Wiener Jingle Jam girl. That's little Kelsey on the Rosie O'Donnell show. Oh, I wish I were an Oscar Mayer Wiener. Then the buns would really relish me. I'm the Oscar Mayer Wiener girl. No one has taken that title from me yet, so I'm still here. I would make the mustard glad and the other wiener sad. And Oscar Mayer would jump the chat with glee. So if I can be a spokesperson for a hot dog wiener contest, I'm pretty sure I can do it for Miss America. They're, they're basically the same. They're like the exact same thing. <laughs> I'm kidding, they're not. 